providing more specialized services for heart patients. Today, News for Jacks toured Baptist Medical Center's new hybrid operating room alongside special guest, national sports reporter Jennifer Hale. Inside the OR, simple procedures and full-scale surgeries can happen in the same space with the push of a button. It's a unique operating room for heart patients. It's designed for minor procedures, but... We can push a button and that machine completely gets out of the way and will go to a corner. Baptist Medical Center's new hybrid operating room can immediately convert to handle a full medical team if a patient's condition changes and full-fledged open-heart surgery is suddenly needed. I've been doing this for 10 years and have never needed to convert to open, but we're always prepared because if we need to convert to open, we need to convert in two minutes, 30 seconds. Here in town to help tout the new technology, national sports reporter Jennifer Hale, who's been haunted by her own deadly heart condition. Right before diagnosis, my feet, ankles, and uh, legs started swelling up pretty significantly, and that's when I thought, this must be something other than just fatigue. At 38 years old, Hale was diagnosed with dilated cardiomyopathy. Her heart was enlarged and was only pumping at about 16 percent. She was sent to a heart specialist in New Orleans who gave her medicine to reduce the size of her heart. And she was outfitted with a defibrillator for eight months to shock her heart if it were to stop. And it's really amazing that in a 20 year span, I take a couple pills a day and I'm back to my old self, whereas it was a death sentence for the rest of my family members. She's beyond thankful there's treatment for her condition, the same ailment that killed her father, uncle and grandfather. After her experience, she was impressed touring the new hybrid OR at Baptist Medical Center Jacksonville. The fact that a patient can get a new heart valve and be out of here in two or three days, walking in a few hours, what that does to you mentally, I promise you, it's huge. Well, two years after being diagnosed, Jennifer Hale's medicine has worked so well, she was taken off a heart transplant list. She was also scheduled to speak tonight at a local women's health gathering, encouraging everyone to know their family's health history, to catch hidden conditions sooner for a better chance at fixing them.